Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to share with you my Aero video sale haul and I'm actually going to show you my entire Aero collection. I don't have a lot of titles but with this last uh, sale I think that happened last month I was able to pick up a few more titles. Uh, I may have shared this on the channel before but previously these are my previous uh, titles. I only had two reanimator and there's the back and look at all the special features on that. Just hold up for a minute here and you can you can uh, pause the screen and uh, look at those. Tons of extra features on that. And uh, I also had this one, Ronin, one of my favorite John Frankenheimer movies. And there's the back of that one as well. This one also has a slip cover on it, which I was pretty excited about. And so there's the inside there without the slip cover. And so those were the only two that I had in my collection. And uh, last month there was a sale and I was able to pick up a few more titles so I'm going to share those with you today. And the first one is um, The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On. I really don't know anything about this film but I've heard this movie recommended on a number of different um, uh, channels and so I thought I would pick this one up. This one's got a lot of extra features on it as well but I really don't know that much about it but I'm excited to watch it. Um, so that's one of the ones I picked up. I've been really into Al Pacino films lately, so this is a William Friedkin movie, uh, Al Pacino in Cruising. I think this is this is one I did not have a copy of, and I thought, what a great time to pick this up from the um, Arrow sale. So I'm excited to rewatch this one. I've seen it before, but again, I've been watching a lot of Al Pacino films this year. This next one was recommended by uh, Brian from Just the Discs on his YouTube channel, I believe, and it's a movie called The Sender which I really know nothing about again, but he recommended it. And so I'm sure it's going to be great. Um, again, lots of extra features on these. And I'm not going to read through all the extra features, but, uh, you know, Arrow does such a great job of also adding additional features. I'm a huge fan of special features, so it's great to pick these titles up. Wow, I've been waiting for this film for a long time and I'm happy that I have a copy of it now. This was also recommended by Brian, but I knew about this film before. This is FM and what a great soundtrack this has too. A lot of the, a lot of the songs I love from the 70s are on this uh, soundtrack. I remember seeing this movie a long time ago and just haven't seen it in the longest time. And so this has a ton of ec um, extra features on it as well. Um, so this is, this is going to be great to see again. Another film that I've heard is one of Quentin Tarantino's uh, favorites, and I think I also heard this on Brian's channel, but it's a movie called Model Shop. And uh, I'm told, again, I haven't seen, well, I've seen part of this movie, I think on TCM at one point, but um, part of this movie, um, well, it seems like it was used as an inspiration for Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, Quentin Tarantino's latest movie. And I'm told, anyway, it features a lot of um, driving shots around Los Angeles, which I'm a big fan of anyway. So Model Shop, I'm excited to rewatch. Um, let's see. Uh, being a big Brian De uh, Palma fan, this is a movie that I did not have. Raising Kane with John Lithgow. I've heard this is really good. I probably saw it years ago, but haven't seen it in quite a while. So I'm happy to add this one. I'm trying to uh, fill in the gaps in some of my favorite directors, and this is one that I did not have a copy of. And a couple more here. Um, um, this is The Bird with the Crystal Plumage, Dario Argento. I only have one Argento film at this point. I have seen this movie before. I think I picked this up at, the li at my local library and watched it and really enjoyed it. So I'm happy to have a copy of it. This, again, has a lot of extra features on it. And um, so I'm excited to watch this. I'm just excited to get into Argento. So if you have any uh, recommended Argento uh, films, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to uh, explore a few more of his movies. And finally, uh, I know this had a lot of special releases, but I, don't, I didn't have a copy of it, and I thought I should really pick it up, and it is RoboCop. I know there's been a couple of different releases of this with a slipcover. I think there was a box set, if I'm not mistaken. But I didn't have a copy of it, and look again, look at all the special features there on the back. Um, again, really excited to explore this movie. I have seen it before. And uh, so, Robocop. Um, so that's going to 
that's my entire now uh, Aero video collection, which I've expanded quite a bit with this last sale. If you participated in the sale, let me know what you picked up. If you have any recommendations from Aero video, let me know also in the comments below. And thanks so much for watching this video today. I really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe. That would be great. I sincerely hope that everyone is safe and well, and I'll talk to you soon.